Welcome back to Becker's Realty, your ultimate source for all things auto real estate. Today, we're diving deep into the latest statistics for the auto real estate market in September of 2023. Whether you're a homeowner, prospective buyer, or simply fascinated by market trends, this update is packed with valuable insights, so let's get to it. We're gonna dive right into the numbers. In September of 2023, a total of 946 homes were sold in the Ottawa Real Estate Board. Interestingly, this figure remained unchanged from the same month in 2022. However, it is worth noting that while the number of homes sold was steady, sales activity for September fell significantly below historical averages. Home sales for the month were 29% below the five-year average and 23% below the 10-year average. Zooming out for a broader perspective, the year-to-date home sales figure reveals a substantial decline over the first nine months of 2023. Total of 9,800 homes were sold, representing a stark 13% drop compared to the same period of 2022. Sales activity in September lines closely with last year's performance, but remains below what we typically see in this month. Now let's shift our focus to price trends, where the MLS Home Price Index provides a more accurate gauge. In September of 2023, the overall MLS Home Price Composite benchmark stood at 643,000, which shows a modest 0.5% increase compared to last year. Breaking it down by property types, single family homes had a benchmark price of 727,000, virtually unchanged, the slight increase of 0.6%. Meanwhile, townhouse and row house units saw a small gain boasting a benchmark price of 510,000, up 2.5% from last year. In contrast, the benchmark apartment price was 422,000, reflecting a decline of 1.1%. The average price of homes sold in September was 675,000, a 2.7% increase from last year. For a more comprehensive view, the year-to-date average price was 672,000, reflecting a 6.5% decrease from the first nine months of 2022. It's essential to remember that while average sale price is a valuable indicator for tracking trends over time, it shouldn't be solely relied upon to determine the value of specific properties. Property prices can vary significantly from one neighborhood to another. Turning our attention to inventory and new listings, September 2023 witnessed a notable uptick in new listings, which surged 9.8% compared to last year. Active residential listings reached 2,999 units by the end of September, marking a substantial 14% increase from 2022. This surge brought active listings to their highest levels for the month of September in five years. As for months of inventory, it stood at 3.2 at the end of 2023, which was up from the 2.8 months in September of 2022. It remains below the monthly average of 3.3 months for this time of year. It's worth noting that there's an expected interest rate hike coming at the end of October on the 25th, and it'll be interesting to see how this impacts the market further. Currently, what we're seeing is that seller expectations and buyer expectations are not quite lining up. So there's lots of buyers still out there with the housing crisis, the lack of inventory that we're having. However, we're not able to come to agreements because sellers still have the previous expectations, whereas buyers are predicting what's to come with a likely price reduction coming. That concludes our in-depth Ottawa real estate market update for September of 2023. Whether you're contemplating a home purchase or sale in Ottawa, or simply seeking to stay informed about market dynamics, be sure to subscribe and activate notifications for this channel. Thank you for joining us at Becker's Realty, where we keep you well informed about everything Ottawa real estate and the evolving real estate landscape. Until next time, We'll see you then.